Hello, here we go again. Just wanted to get out and beat the heat again and get some more kilometers down on my InMotion V13. I'm gonna head to a new place today. I've never been here before. It's called uh, the Wetlands, Archerfield Wetlands. I saw just looking on a map, looking for places to go and take my new wheel. And yeah, it's supposed to be a nice place. So we'll just go for a roll today, see what happens on our adventures. Thanks for coming back to my channel. It's a horrible drive to here. Drive, wheel, roll. Yeah, that was kind of horrible. It was just so many stop starts along the way and it was so busy with traffic and big heavy traffic. And then most of those footpaths weren't really designed to be footpaths for bikes, I guess. And they all had weird angles and weird cambers and to hold a wheel like this is really tough. You know, when you're just standing with one foot at the light, so. This is nice. Well, anyway, I found the wetlands. This is the start of the wetlands. I got a bit lost and I was kind of so hot and a bit over it in the traffic. I thought I might just head back, but no, let's do this. Oh, here's a like massive parade of tractors. <laughs> I found like where they live. This is where they all come to hibernate after a hard day in the pastures. I guess, you know, see all that leaf litter that they're flicking up. You gotta watch that on the corners. If you're on a motorbike as well, you know, those sometimes those tires can just slide out on that grass. So yeah. Here we are, so this is the wetlands. This isn't far from home and I thought I might check it out to come and bring the family. If it's nice anyway. But it's a bit out of the way and um, that's good for this wheel and me and getting used to things and the tire still tries to track sometimes. I've still got things at 35 PSI and getting my pedals in the right spot, everything else is starting to feel good. But yeah, all this loose grass, gravel. All terrain adventure today. I'm really liking the tire, this um, stock tire. It's grown on me a lot. I mean, it's got its quirks. I think, you know, if it starts to track, we've seen that go back a few videos and I took a bit of a spill. But other than that, you know, the versatility of it, I've got it into the dirt trails. I can just roll off a nice footpath and straight into something like this. And I've still got confidence that I can hold a line. And I really haven't tested it to its extreme yet. You know, I think I could really probably lean a lot more than I am. Oh, this is feeling good now. I'm glad I came. Look at this. Well, okay, nearly had a bit of a slide there. So yeah, I'll turn the cameras off and I might just put some music on and we'll just get out with the scenery. It looks like we've got the place to ourselves. I got out really early and uh, I've never been here. So I'll try to get to know what we've got to deal with. And get some kilometers down there's quite a bit of wind so that's dragging on me and you know this is really loose gravel here so I don't know where it goes or how long it goes it's nice all right I'm gonna turn this off and just enjoy the moment I kind of thought that it went for a little bit longer than that. That's it, but that was fun, I guess. Well, I don't know. I mean, I've got no much more to say today. Maybe that's just it. Look, we're coming up at 750 kilometers on this wheel. We'll hit that today. And I'm in love with it. Like I'm every, every single time I roll on this, Well, that was a, like a good good little workout for, for me this morning. I think every day you'll get back on the wheel, I'm still feeling it. Like, 
this this wheel's got some weight. If this is your first wheel, you know, I wish you luck. Because it does take a lot to just keep it going and to, you know, it fatigues you, I guess. Especially in this heat and, you know, all the stopping and starting. Same thing happens on a motorbike. If you've got a sports bike, like I ride a sports bike and it's my commuter sometimes, and you're in the traffic, stop starting. It's just no joy. But, you know, you get it to the right environment and you open it up a little bit on some corners and it, it, it's all joy. Well, but, you know, a wheel that you can do this on and just find a little spot that looks okay to roll and off you go. You find these new places, little secret areas and it's just fun sometimes to get out and explore. It's made wheels have made me explore so much more. So yeah, new hobbies and new ways to explore and that's what this wheel is opening up for me. Again, I've never been here um, and it was just a quick decision to look at a map, look at where there's a couple of bike paths and off you go. And this wheel is outstanding for everything I've put it through, every place I need to go, it's done its job. So it won't be long until we hit the thousand kilometers and then I might even look at opening it up a little bit and just, I want to check over all of the screws, make sure everything's holding up, keep an eye on the suspension. Again, that still feels good. I've really got that dialed in. I still can't decide how I like my pedals. Even just then I took it back one degree because it just wasn't feeling it. Hello. I do, it makes it easier, I think. It makes it easier on the hips, that's for sure. You have a lovely day. I'll hit the button for you.